Good morning, uh, Devin. My name is Mrs. Lemos, and I'm your ELA teacher. Um, I wanted to just take some time to explain some things to you because I know on Zoom, like I, I don't really want to take a lot. It, there's just a lot of information that I need for you to know before you get started. And it's also for your parents. And I welcome you to our campus. Uh, we're so happy to have you. And we understand that this is not a normal situation. And so definitely I am so reachable. Uh, Schoology um, email, we do provide um, tutoring Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, 8 a.m. to 3, 8 a.m. to 8.30 p. 8.30 a.m. to 8 a.m. to 8.30 a.m., sorry, in the morning, or in the afternoon, 4 to 4.30 p.m. All you have to do is just send me an email uh, or a Schoology message saying, Mrs. Lemos, can I meet with you for a little bit in the morning or in the afternoon, and I will send you a, a Zoom link so you can, so we can actually have some tutoring time. Um, there is going to be a period of adjustment because you are just barely getting to know all of us. Uh, and so I just want to walk you through and anytime that you need to refer back to this video, you may do so. So first of all, I'm going to just show you um, your, we are on week five right now. And I'm going to walk you through some things. This is your calendar, your academic calendar. You are going to just uh, look through your calendar um, and it has very important dates. Don't worry about me explaining things right now about details. I know this looks crazy, uh, but when you scroll on the, when you put your cursor on the calendar and you scroll, you can see the dates to come. I am going to be telling you over and over again what's happening, I promise. Then the next thing is called a week at a glance. This is exactly what we're doing for the week. There are kind of it's like the title of the things that we're doing for the week. So we're on Wednesday, I'm sorry, on Thursday, we're gonna uh, make meaningful in inferences from a photograph. And then we're also going to understand the controlling idea of an essay. This is very important um, right here. It'll tell you, and every week it'll stay there, what were the assignments of the week, okay? So definitely whenever there's a number, a number sign and the number or what you call a hashtag and then the number it'll that's going to be an assignment that i'm grading okay and then of course you have your folders Mon monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday and then i'm going to go ahead and click thursday that's where we're on uh you're oh before i go there hold on so i'm going to click the third nine weeks okay so you need a you will need a composition book like this, okay? And what you're gonna do, Devin, is um, you're gonna click, hold on, let me see where I'm at. Okay, right here, writing journal live updates. So you're gonna expand it right here. There's a little, a little square and you click it, it'll look like that, okay? You're gonna copy the first page in this book like this of course you're not going to write my name you're going to write your name okay and then your second page is going to look like this but instead of the sticky notes you're going to write what i asked you to write in the purple anytime you want to pause this so you can do this you can do it as well okay um you're going to start right here well actually uh yes you're going to start from right here Okay, I am going to try, I, I want you to copy what you see from the third nine weeks all the way down. Make sure you write a page number. Of course, you're going to start with page one. Mrs. Lemos, you told me to write this one. This is not page one. This is not page one. You're going to, um, this is not page one either because you're going to save like three pages that say table of contents on here. So let me go back. It's gonna be, this is the first page. As soon as you open the book, that's where this is gonna be. Then the, after that page, it's gonna be this page. Then you're going to save like four pages back in front. That's gonna say table of contents. Then the first page of the table of contents, you're gonna add page number one, third nine weeks. 
okay, uh, I'm sorry, you're going to label it third nine weeks and then page one under that. Page one is going to be CNN 10 Reflection. Save like two or three pages for CNN Reflection, only for that. Then page two is going to be SSR Reflection. Save two or three pages for that. Then your third page is going to be expository essay vocabulary. Okay. So hopefully that makes sense. Again, um, page one is going to be CNN 10 reflection, page two, SSR reflection. These are the titles that are going to be in your page. So once you put it in your table of contents, you're going to go to the cleanest page. You're going to go to the this page and then this is going to be number one page one cnn 10. then you're going to skip three pages one two three and maybe four because we we write a lot on those pages okay then after that this is going to be page two it's going to be called ssr you're going to put page two ssr reflection then you're going to skip three pages one, two, three. Then page three is going to be expository essay vocabulary. Okay. And you're going to go down and down and up. The rest of them are all one pagers. Okay. Uh, well, um, you know what? To make it just easier a little bit, make sure that you save two pages per title. Because I don't know how long it's going to, you know what I mean? I don't know how long. But again, you are gonna you're gonna start from the very beginning of our uh, of our week. You're gonna go to week one, and you're gonna start your assignments from there. There there's nothing hard. I promise you, everything is very very easy. The only hard thing I do probably think is gonna be your notes. Okay, but don't worry about that. From there. Uh, now you're gonna skip all the way. You're gonna skip 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 skip. Okay, you're going to scroll all the way down until you hit third nine weeks. This is where you're going to start. Okay, so all the pages, look, they're right here. So instead of page 33, it's going to be one, and you're going to skip three pages. And then page two, SSR reading, skip a couple of pages. Expository essay vocabulary, skip two pages. Compound sentences notes, skip two pages. Expository mentor essay, skip two pages. You see what I'm saying? So they're all here, everyone. So I, I haven't added a couple of them that belong in here, but I will update it, I promise, okay? So that's very, very important. So here you are, you're gonna start on week one. Every day, Devin, I don't know about week one, but starting week two, I have videos for everything. Every day has videos. So just go through them, um, uh, like I said, like week two, Monday, you don't have this. This is only for second period. You do not have this. So you see like right here, I have an agenda right here. And it says, number one, watch my video. Number two, CNN 10 reflection page. Number three, number four. Okay. This is just written. But here, I actually have a video of the instructions. Okay, and then you follow along all the pages, and then I have every almost everything has video instructions, so it's going to be super super easy to follow. Okay, these assignments, these um, these days are created for the person at home. Okay, so it's it's very very easy. I don't make anything hard. Um, and then today I'll explain everything what you're doing, uh, but other than that. I think that is it. Please message me with any questions. Your class is going to begin at 2.24. Um, be here on time because I start with a lot of information. And again, I'm trying to, uh, we're not trying to make, we're not trying to ace the star, but we're not, we want you to be comfortable enough to take it, okay? Uh, like I said, I welcome you to our class and I can't wait to meet you. And please, uh, anytime that you need me, let me know. Ask me questions. Uh, oh, one more thing. Um, whenever you turn in an assignment, 
whenever you turn in an assignment, um, we do a lot of things in the writing journal, a lot of assignments in the writing journal. And how I do this, Devin, is I tend to attach slides. Wrong one. Hold on. I tend to attach slides, Google Slides, to your assignment, but you have to take the best photos of your assignment and then add them to the slides. So please make sure that you have your school email, well, whatever. Don't take pictures with your laptop. Don't take pictures with your laptop. Um, hold on. Oh, do, okay, so yeah, do not take pictures with your laptop because they don't take the they don't take the best pictures. Just ignore me right now. I'm I forgot to do something here. Um, hold on. Twenty six. What is this called? Twenty six. Uh. Okay. Um, so I'm sorry, I had to do that right in front of me. I'm so sorry. Uh, so make sure like, okay, so now it's, it's ready. Um, so like this assignment you're doing in your, I'm just, this is an example you're doing in your writing journal. And then what I tend to do is I give you slides like this and you add your pictures on here okay it's going to look something like this i'm going to show you an example of a student Hold on. Wrong student. Oh, i'm sorry i'm so sorry Devin. hold on this one So yeah, look, you see how crisp her pictures are? Okay, so definitely that's the way it's supposed to look. Um, make sure you can upload these pictures to your, your cell phone, send them to yourself, and then in your device, you can upload them. Or you can also use the drive in your cell phone Okay, you can use a device in, uh, you can use your drive in your cell phone and you can add these pictures to your slides on your phone with your, your drive, your school drive. Okay, hopefully you already have all that. Please let me know if you don't and I will help you with that. So again, that is my expectation. That's how you turn in your work by inserting pictures, good pictures of your um, assignments. Um, I... I do make sure that you write in complete sentences, that there's no spelling errors. You do have a device to look up any spellings that you do not know. Um, everything is capitalized where it needs to be. And of course, the word I always needs to be capitalized. Okay. Alrighty, Devin, I'm so sorry that this was too long. I didn't expect it to be so long. But again, this is a warm, a warm bienvenidos, welcoming to you, uh, into our family. I do hope to talk to you and communicate with you. And mom, if you're watching this, Welcome aboard to the Rebel family. Uh, we are here to support you in any way that we can. Um, you all have a blessed day. Stay safe. Thank you so much.